This is not a complicated mechanic for gameplay. You're moving, you're clicking things, and you're reading stuff, but... For me, anyway, playing. I don't know about watching. Oh shit! Hey, hello, how's it going? Hope you're having a very nice day and week. I'm playing a game today called Zero Visibility, which uh, reads as follows. Four friends driving through the mountains. Can't see anything but snow. More lost with every second that passes. Something's out there lurking in the fog. Something sinister. There's no turning back now. The only way is through. Though it's described as a chilling cosmic horror game about four friends that get lost in a blizzard. I hope you enjoy it. Let's see what it's like. So yeah, like the video if you do enjoy it. Let me know in the comments what you thought of it. And subscribe if you're new to the channel. I would appreciate it. So, let's just play. Leo. Guys, it can't be that big of a deal. I'm sure it's cool, but... And then Elaine. Yeah, no, it's just a lot of fun. Lloyd. Elaine, you should be ashamed of yourself. It's everything. Your life up to now was empty, and you didn't even realise it. It's just been a long, sad preamble. A long preamble to Hot Springs? You know it, baby. Hot Springs doesn't really describe it well. It's more like a really warm river. When someone pees in the water near you, but all the time. You're a poet, Lloyd. Aren't things like this better in the summer? Nah, nothing like a so nothing like soaking in hot water surrounded by snow. Size. <sighs> I'll take your word for it. Looks like we're about 40 minutes out. God, will you quit it with map? <coughs> will you quit it with map? It's just Chalk Creek Road all the way up. <laughs> okay, good. It's not all dialogues. I need to fucking drink my coffee. I am steering. Look out, world. <laughs> so yeah, a bit of a different game to one I usually play. It just intrigued me. And I'll play what I like. Really? Was there snow in the forecast? Nope. I checked this morning. It's the mountains, dude. Anything can happen. Will they still be open? Of course they'll be open. Hot springs don't close for snow. Great. Well, drive slow. I couldn't go much faster even if I wanted to. A trash mobile can barely handle these hills. Hey. Intriguing. So I don't know if it's going to have a couple of different styles of gameplay like this, and then when we're out and see, it's going to be a dialogue heavy one. This I can't see shit. The snow's really picking up. This doesn't look good. Maybe, maybe we should go back. We're way closer to the hot springs than we are to home, and we can stay there overnight if we need to. Ugh, of course, this had to happen today. The one day we were all free. It's fine, Sarah. Just focus on driving. We've got a map. You've all been here before. <laughs> okay, but everyone be on the lookout for street signs. You all know the Donna Party? If that is the sort of Donna Party I'm thinking I want to be there. Uh, well, when we inevitably get around to eating each other... Shut up, Boyd. You're not helping. I'm keeping up morale. Anyways, I vote we eat Leo first. Hunter. So look out for road signs. I feel cold playing this game. I feel like I need to put my Udi on. This wind is... Relentless. Oh! What was that? You saw that in the middle of the road. Rewind if you didn't. I saw it. Hold up, Sarah. There's a street sign. What's it say? I can't read it from here. Me neither. Hold on. I'll pull over. We'll just hop out and take a look. 15 seconds tops. We could just drive up to it. I bet we could get a nice marbled steak out of Leo. Shut up, Boyd. Maybe it's chilly. <laughs> I have to get out. Oh, squad. Okay. Interesting. That's a fun uh, way of doing it. Inspect. What the hell? What kind of absolute psychopath would do that? Do what? The sign's all scratched out. It's completely illegible. Well, let's think about this logically. We're at a fork. There's a tunnel ahead and a branch off to the side. Leo, is there anything like this on the map? There are like five different forks like this in the area. So we're lost. We're not lost. We didn't take any turns since getting on Chalk Creek. 
we keep moving, we should reach Johnson Village any minute now. Can we discuss this in the car? I'm freezing. Yeah, I... Again. I feel cold. Get in. So... I have to go this way, because that's a tunnel. That looks blocked. There it is again! I'm too cold. Okay, that's better. Got me OD, got woolly socks. It's this game. I, I half blame my house because I don't want to have a heating on much. And this game. Wait, the hell was that? I don't know, the car's chugging. Yeah, but are we leaking oil? Must be out of gas. Oh, we had half a tank like 20 minutes ago. Maybe there's a leak. I mean, that's what those black bits are, right? Oh. Well, we've stopped. Well? What do we do now? We'll freeze if we stay in here. We have to continue on foot. Grab anything warm you can find and bundle up. Oh. Are those vehicles over there? They are. Hold up. Are those fire trucks? We can ask them for help. Looks like a landslide. The doors on the trucks are open. I don't think they're still here. There are footprints in the snow. They look fresh. Oh, I can turn the camera with my mouse. That's cool. What is that? What the hell? Pretty sinister. I've never seen anything like this. Elaine, you're into rocks, right? Not enough to recognize this. Basalt, maybe? The angles are too perfect. They look man-made. I don't like this. I think we should go back to the way we came. I mean, I don't. This is a really cool mechanic. Oh my god. This is a really cool mechanic. Sarah. Sarah. Huh? What? Why did you stop? I, uh, I'm fine. Let's keep moving. I, it's a cool mechanic because, look, I can turn all the way around. I don't know why it's impressing me so much, but it just feels like a very 2D game, especially with the characters, to then be able to look 360. Um, it's really cool. Jesus, this thing is old. Looks like a model train kit. Like a kid got frustrated and tossed it across the room. I mean, it does, doesn't it? What's that? Wait, there's something here. A pile of rocks? No, there's a note on it. Please send help. One of us is injured, and the blizzard is only getting worse. There are fresh footprints in the snow, but we've searched for hours and haven't found a soul. We tried to retrace our steps, but we can't find the way out. We've been waiting for a search party, but with this weather, I don't think it's coming. The bridge is damaged, but we think we can fix it. If you find this note, we've gone ahead. Maybe we'll find a way off this damn mountain. I don't like this. We should go back the way we came. See, they keep saying that, but I don't want to, and I'm not going to, but I wonder what would happen if I did. This doesn't look sturdy at all. It's the only way forward, so it doesn't matter if it's sturdy or not. When did we put Sarah in charge? Shut up, Boyd. You're not helping. No, but actually, does this seem unnecessarily dangerous to anyone else? We're climbing across an old rickety bridge above a spike pit. I think we should- you keep saying this, I think we should go back the way we came. We can try to make it back down the foot. The mountain on foot. The last town on the way back was three hours from here by car. I think we'll make it on foot in the blizzard. Yeah, shut up, boys. We're going on the rickety bridge. I don't understand what that is. Okay, Sarah- is it Sarah's- in, in Sarah's head? What's up with you? Did- Did you all see- can we talk about this when we're not two steps from falling to our deaths? Boyd's right, we can't stop here. 
So Sarah's getting visions, basically, and Sarah's who I'm controlling. I like the changes. The, the, I like the camera angle changes. It's it's just a good a good game. I'm very impressed. And I wish this was a demo for a, a longer game, to be honest. But okay, so past the spice. There's another note. Another note, and the note says, "I don't know how long I've been here. Weeks, years." Time doesn't have meaning here. The snow never stops. There's no day or night. Get away from that food. Chastise in my cat. Um, fires never stop burning. Footprints never fade. I'm freezing. I have no food. I'm still alive. I found a note on the other side of the bridge. Whoever wrote it seems to have vanished without a trace. Maybe they went on ahead. Or maybe they were rescued. There's no way back. All the paths are blocked. I want to keep moving forward. I feel like I need to. But it doesn't make any sense. I don't trust the feeling. It's false. I should be waiting for rescue or looking for food. I'm not going further up the mountain. But I need to reach the peak. I need to understand. Please find me. I'm so alone. What are we doing? We should be going back. Boyd, is Boyd going to end up being right? Should I have just turned around and then game over? <laughs> Holy shit, is that a house? Or like a shack? Maybe they have a phone? I'd be surprised if they have a fucking toilet. Shut up, Boyd. Thank God, finally some luck. I mean, it's litter. What just... Elaine! Fuck, fuck, fuck. What? Wait, where is she? Did you not see it? Something... i I be honest, I, it took me a while to see it. Everyone, slow down. What happened? <laughs> what the hell's going on? I think... I think I saw something take Elaine. Something? Like what, a bear? I, I don't know. Where'd they go? Well, we need to help her. Where did they go? Down. Down? Into the snow. Snow's not that deep. How can something go down into the snow? I don't fucking know. I'm just telling you what I saw. The footsteps just stop. Come on, let's check the house. If there's someone there, maybe they can help. Well, that was some intense music. Hello? Is anyone there? You need a phone? Our friend, leave. I don't have a phone. Please, we need help. I have a gun. Go. Just go and no one gets hurt. Thank God he has a gun. Please, our friend was taken by something. We need... Open the window. He said leave. Oh. Oh, Lord. You're... Just a bunch of kids. Please, sir, something took our friend. We need your help. You have a gun. You could... The gun's empty. You used the last bullet years ago. Listen. Please listen to me. I know this is hard to hear. Please. Don't go looking for your friend. Are you fucking nuts? Look, just listen. That thing that took your friend will only attack if you try to reach the peak. If you don't try to move forward, it'll leave you alone. I'm the proof. Please. I've seen dozens of groups like yours, and they all end up... What the fuck are you talking about? Are we going to leave Elaine out there? I even tried to find her. No, no, you're right. We need to keep moving. Please don't do this. You're just kids. I can't let kids... I don't give a shit what you think. Oh, boy. I'm not leaving a friend to die because some old man in a shack said so. If we want to catch up to them, we need to leave now. You're right, let's go. And then there were three. Oh, goodness. So we are ignoring the warning from the man in the shack. Another note. We've decided to take the only open route it leads further up the mountain. We'll keep moving until we find a path to take us back down. At least that's my plan. The others are behaving strangely. Almost like they've given up on rescue. Or even finding our own way home. All they talk about is reaching the top of the mountain. 
Maybe there's something in the air. A hallucinogen or something. Maybe it's just the hunger and the cold. It might be getting to me too. I've been seeing a silhouette. Just out of sight in the fog. I haven't gotten a good look at it yet. Anytime I catch a glimpse, it disappears. At first, I thought it was a mountain lion, but now I'm not convinced. There's intelligence there, like we're being investigated. I guess wait and see what we do. The further we move up the mountain, the closer it gets. Maybe it's just a hallucinogen, but I'm starting to think moving forward isn't such a good idea. I don't trust the others anymore, but I can't bring myself to split up with that thing out there in the fog. Please find us. I don't want to die up here. Whew. It's a really good focus, this game. See, this game, straightforward gameplay. The focus is on the narrative, which for me trumps the gameplay nine times out of ten. Okay, unless it was like complete ass gameplay. I'm not saying it, you know, that doesn't matter at all, but this is not a complicated mechanic for gameplay. You're moving, you're clicking things, and you're reading stuff, but for me anyway, playing, I don't know about watching. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Leo, where did it go? Where the fuck did it go? Boyd. Fuck. Boyd. We, we need to keep moving. What's gone into you? It's got Elaine and Theo. They could be dead for all we know, and... You think I don't care? You think I'm pushing forward because I want to? What do we stand to gain by staying here, hmm? I... We're sitting ducks. We stand a better chance if we keep moving. We can go back and keep moving forward. We really don't care. But I'm not going to wait here for it to take us to... Oh shit, and then there's two. Looks like some sort of camp. This is... this is so fucked. At least it's warm. They were more prepared than us. Oh, were they though? I can't believe we found it. It's more incredible than I could have imagined. Our measurements were correct. The gravitational fluctuations are more stronger than our initial calculations. Time is warped here beyond any current understanding scientific explanation. Whatever this place is seems to have been floating through space and time since long before the birth of our sun. What are the chances of it crossing Earth? Trillions to one? So this place, there's a logic to it. Boyd, I think this was a research crew. I... I don't want to know. Let's just... Just keep moving. Holy shit. It looks like they were pulled out of their tents. Okay, that was the other way to get up here. Alright, well, we keep moving, and guess who's at the back void? You. I can't sprint. But as I was, before I was interrupted, yeah, this game is just focusing mainly on the narrative, which I don't know about watching, but playing, I love it. Emma. I don't feel cold anymore. I don't feel much of anything, really. The bridge still isn't done. I don't know how long I've been here. Ben and Drew are gone. Whatever those things are took them. I made graves for them. Felt like the right thing to do. I wonder if someone will make a grave for me too. Adam. Oh, that's sad. Well, the bridge isn't done, yet I'm crossing it. Oh my god, are those people down there? Watch your step, Boyd. It's a long way down. Boyd? Boyd, are you okay? Boyd has become mute. Ooh, what's that structure? Crikey. Another note, another grave. Rest in peace. Adam, someone did make a grave for him. Everyone deserves a proper burial. Okay, Adam got what he wanted, but look at all the other graves. Oh, there's more graves up here. Oh my word. Is this just on a mountaintop? Sarah. I don't think we're supposed to be here. What are you talking about? This place. 
Whoever built it didn't want people to come here. It's so threatening. It feels like a warning. I want to go back. I want to go home. Wait, we can't go back. I know. I know. Whew. One last note. My companions refused to believe. That's why they were taken. They lacked faith. God brought us here. We were chosen. And they didn't live up to expectations. I've never been the religious type, but this place is all the proof I need. I don't know what kind of God lies at the end of this path, but I can't deny its power. I've seen it with my own two eyes. And I'm choosing to believe. Oh God, religious mumbo jumbo. Someone's convinced. No, Boyd! No! Fuck, fuck, fuck. <laughs> Going in. Whoa. Fuck are these pictures? So you got someone... I mean, they've all got that upside down man. Ch people in chains, someone falling from great height and there's already bodies on the floor. And they're like falling to earth, I don't know. What's this one? Those are the things that have been capturing us. And there he is again, the upside down man. I don't know. Oh my god. So am I not going to get captured? Am I a believer? I don't know. I'm the only one that's been getting those visions. Oh god, I, I do feel uneasy. People on spikes. Okay. Spin it around to the note. Uh, the architecture is incredible. I've never seen anything like it. No human built this. There's some sort of being up ahead. The others call it God, but I don't think that's the right word. It's incredible. Unknowable. The creature hunting us doesn't want us to reach it. I don't know how, but I can feel it. I'm almost there. We live our lives searching for something incredible. Something unique. Something worth dying for. That's what at the end of this patch. That's what's at the end of this path. path. Something worth dying for. If I keep pushing forward, I'll be the first to see it. I know it's worth it. It has to be worth it. Christine Rowe, 1936. Right. So these are the people that have tried to get here and failed. So back away. Wow. Okay. So more bodies. Oh my word. Oh, okay, I need to build the bridge by the looks of it. I killed one of them. One of those monsters following us. Whoa! They move faster than anything I've ever seen, but they bleed red just like us. There should only be one left now. After I finish the bridge, I'll hunt it down and kill it too. Fair play. Anything that stands between us and God needs to be extinguished. Whoa, where's the body then if you killed one of them? Plank, 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 and hammer. Build. 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 There he is. Hello, you ca- Oh my god, are those- They're my family. He's doing lines and dots and stuff, I don't understand. Oh. They're my family! My friends, whoever the fuck they are to me, oh my god.
Oh my god. I finally made it. It's... It's incredible. They were right. It was worth it. It was all worth it. Unknown. I don't know what that says. Ah. I just got absorbed into him. started the apocalypse. Yes. That was on the photos. Wow. Wow. What's archive? That's all the artwork. Wow, that's cool. What a game. Please let me know your thoughts, even if it's only a brief comment. I love that game. Just, that's just me to a T. Just focus on story. The gameplay doesn't have to be too much. It doesn't have to be jump scares. Because that was still creepy as balls at times. Oh, well done, developer. I'll have to see if he's made anything else, because that was a fantastic game. Um, yeah, like I said, when the focus is on the narrative instead of the gameplay. No, that's their first game. Fucking brilliant. Love that. So yeah, let me know what you thought. I thought the atmosphere was great. I thought the story was great. Um, the artwork, really nice. I haven't got any negatives for that one. So yeah, thanks for watching my video. I hope you enjoyed it. And uh, yeah, have a nice rest of your day and I'll see you in the next video.